<laughs> Good morning. <laughs> it is Monday. We get married on Saturday. We're so excited. Is that not insane? Um, also, Wait, I know. My lens is a little dirty. I know that I'm driving. <laughs> but show them. Oh yeah, we're just like we're literally three miles per hour. Yep. Is that what that three. Any hoodlum. <laughs> Taryn loves when I say her phrases. We are going to pick up our wedding dresses. Woo! And Taryn's suit Woo! for the after party. I still don't know what I'm wearing to the after party. I've shared on like TikTok and Instagram a bunch of options and got y'all's opinions and I'm still stumped. She's stumped. We leave Wednesday morning as soon as we wake up. So to, all we have is today and tomorrow <laughs> to get this shit together. Okay, we are home from picking up our wedding dresses. It didn't go great. <laughs> our seamstress definitely needs an assistant. I think she just doesn't have a great scheduling system going on. Last time when we were there, there was somebody, I don't know if they showed up early or if she double booked, but someone was like waiting while we were in our appointment and our appointment was supposed to be an hour. And we were there for maybe, I don't know, 20, 30 minutes. And both of us had to try on our wedding gowns. Taryn had, a suit and three pairs of pants she needed done so it was just a little hectic and Taryn went first and had to do all that and then I had like two minutes for my dress I basically like put it on and took it off and I didn't really get a good look at it so I left that appointment feeling a little stressed and like I don't know if it looks good so this time we went we got there and she was like what time's your appointment and we we're like nine and she didn't have it on her books but I think it's because she didn't write it down when we left the last time because she quickly had to take the other customer. She couldn't find any of our stuff. We were like, couldn't find my veil, couldn't find Taryn's suit. Taryn's dress wasn't pressed yet. It was just like a little bit of a shit show. And then my dress just didn't look so great. So I kind of started to panic a little <laughs> just because we really only have today and tomorrow. And then we leave first thing Wednesday morning to go to Palm Springs. And it's pretty far of a drive to go get the dress. Now I'm just feeling a little overwhelmed because I need to go drive all the way back out there tomorrow and just hope that everything looks good. But I think it will. I mean, I feel like I have a lot of faith in her skills. I think she was just rushed and the time management wasn't there and the scheduling wasn't there. All of a sudden there's just so much to do and so little time to do it. And I'm just feeling like, I don't know how everything's gonna get done. Okay, I had to get myself ready really quickly because I actually have to film some things for work really quick, even though I don't have time for that. We're just gonna power through it. Wish me luck. <gasps> oh! <laughs> Woo! Like, Mom! They chase me! Oh! We get married in four days. Uh, not interlock. Oh. Yes. Oh. <laughs> just the tips? Yeah. <laughs> Wedding week, crossword and cereal. Having a little cereal and coffee. Doing a little crossword. Woo! Feeling good? I'm so excited. I finished my vows this morning. Well, I have two directions and I just need to choose which one to read. How are you gonna pick? I might call Tyler, because yeah. he just did his vows and I he feel like some fresh on the mind. Yeah. Um, so I think I'm gonna read him both. Cute. We are one day out from leaving for Palm Springs for our freaking wedding. It is fully setting in. It feels so surreal, but oh my God. I finalized my vows last night and I read them to one of my friends, which was so weird and so nerve wracking. I wasn't going to read them to anyone, but then I was like, I need to just say it out loud to somebody to like process if I like them or not. So I'm gonna tweak them a little bit today and then I think that's it. I'm gonna go run all of my errands. I need to go get my nails and my toes done, pick up our wedding dresses, pick up our wedding day jewelry. Holy freaking shit. <laughs> nails are done. I'm at the alterations place to hopefully pick up our finished dresses. Crossing my fingers, it's gonna be perfect. And hopefully I'll be back here in like five minutes being like, everything's good. Let's see. I got the goods. Oh my God. I can't believe I have our wedding dresses in the car. They look perfect. I'm just so excited, y'all. I'm getting fucking married. Pardon my French, but holy shit. This is crazy. Oh my God. I could cry right now. I'm so stoked. Okay, time to go pick up our jewelry. And then I need to hurry up, get home, and get everything done. Oh my Lord, I have so much to do, so it's kooky, but. This is just too exciting to even feel stressed at this point. I am powering through my errands. I just stopped by Jean Doucette to get some jewelry for what we're wearing for our wedding day. Like, 
I cannot believe they lent us the most stunning pieces. Wait till you see them. They're so pretty. I did not think about like my other jewelry other than my rings. Oh, my eyes are watering. I promise I'm not crying. Maybe I am. I didn't think about my other jewelry other than our rings. We even forgot about our bands for so long. We actually are getting our bands from John Doucette as well. Um, they're trying so hard to get them in in time for somebody to pick them up and take them with them to Palm Springs since we leave tomorrow morning, which is so nice of them. We did it so last minute. We're like, we do not expect y'all to have these bands in time. We will use placeholders or something. It's not the end of the world, but they are like determined to get them to us in time, which is amazing. So now I have like a hour ride home. Yep, 55 minutes. So let's do this. We are here. People are starting to get here. We just had our tans. It's so perfect out. I don't know how we got this lucky. Like yesterday, it was pouring pouring rain so cold today perfection and then it's just supposed to get better and better it looks so pretty because there's like snow capped mountains up there i don't know if you can see we're just having the best time ever are you having a good time Bubby? i'm having the best time everything is going perfect <laughs> i'm not even being sarcastic i'm like literally buzzing <laughs> future wife you look incredible i love you we are ready for rehearsal dinner you look, you look so hot <laughs> I love you. You look so gorgeous. I love that color on you. This is crazy. Soak it in. The sun is, that camera the sun is so just li good. like, I know we look good, but this, oh, it's like making it too dark. The sun just peeked behind there. Oh my God. You ready, love? Let's go party. So We're all getting it looks married. so pretty. You're beautiful. Mm. Hi, baby. Hi. Sorry, we're stuffing our faces. Oh, we are sat here eating. We just got all our pictures done. And all of our friends are at cocktail hour and we can see them because we left the curtains open. <laughs> we're taking a minute to ourselves. But we are so excited to get out there and hang out with everyone. This is I can't wait. the best day of our lives. Best day. Love you. Give me, give me Christina kiss. <laughs> you know, I don't even really know where to begin. Like, every time I get ahead, 